Hey there, it's Nick with Valley Ford. Here's that uh, Volkswagen Beetle that you inquired about. So I figured I'd send you a quick uh, video of it. I don't see any body damage. See, it's got a sticker on the back, which we can take off. I believe we just got this recently. We haven't had it very long at all. Looks like it's got a spot right here and a scratch on the door right here. Uh, we do have a guy that does our touch-up paint. Comes in once a week so we can have him fill that in. That way it's looking top-notch for you. Um, this is what the key fob looks like. There is two keys for it. Looks like it's a convertible. Top looks good. I don't see any tears or anything like that in the top. Let's check out inside here. So the seats. I don't see any damage on the seats. Those look good. Let's see. Oh, it's probably this up here. Yep. Back seats look good too. Start her up for you real quick. Oh, it's a push button start. I've never seen this before. So you think it's a key start. But then if you look right here, that's only if the key fob's dead. So it's got a push button start right here. So I guess you hold the key fob here and push the start button. There we go. Never seen that before, that's interesting. So it's got 55,000 miles on it, as you can see. No check engine lights. <laughs> Let's see. It's got a cubby up here. It's got a cubby right there. Looks like it does have a slap shift, so you put it into drive and then slide it, I think, let's see, probably, there we go, slide it over, and then you can shift the gears up and down manually if you want. Um, let's see. Looks like we have, let's check the AC and all that. Fans definitely work. Make sure it gets cold. The AC recirculate on. Looks like it has heated seats as well for both front seats. It's already starting to get cold, so that's a good sign. Turn the fan down a little bit. Uh, let's see. Looks like it's got the controls for hands-free calling, so you must be able to pair your phone to it. Let's see, I've just never messed with one of these before, so... Oh, looks like you gotta push the power button first. So, let's see... Oh, okay, so you probably push media. No medium is available. Oh, so you switch between AM and FM by pushing band again? It looks like it does have XM radio, so you'll get a free subscription for 90 days. So it has AM, FM, XM, and then Bluetooth for your phone. And it has a CD player as well. Looks like it has nav too. So it does have nav. That's pretty cool. It's uh, a mute button. Setup must be like the settings button. These are just to use the. Uh... The route is being calculated. That's the destination cool. is in the displayed direction. Okay. Let's turn the radio down so we're not listening to that. Oh, it's this one right here. Okay. Um. 
It even gives you the directions up here with your nav. It's pretty cool. Well, let's see, am I missing anything? Oh, uh, the top. Let's see how to do the top here. Um, I've never done this before, so I'm guessing you just hold this button up here. Yep, the windows roll down and the top goes back down into here. So that's good. That looks like that works just fine. So now it's a convertible, obviously. Get out and show you when you're outside the car. So yeah, that top just folds right back down into there. That was really easy to do. Let's see, tires look good. Looks like there's at least probably 60 to 75% left on the treads. It's hard to see, probably in the camera. Let's see. Looks like all four are matching brand of tires. Might be easier to see the tread back here. There's plenty of tread on there, so those look good. And uh, when we get trade-ins, you know the techs, they go through it, they check everything, if something's wrong with it like uh, it needs brakes or something like that or, or an oil change or, or check engine lights on they'll fix that stuff um, let's see let's see uh, we'll put the top back up here so I'm gonna hold the button looks like the tops coming back up and it just goes right back down in there by itself that's really easy so most tops I've seen on convertibles have like latches you have to latch down and up so that's really easy to put the top down and put it right back up. All the windows are working like they're supposed to, which is good. Yep, all the windows work. It looks like it has the Fender audio system, so it should have nicer speakers in here. If there's something else you want me to go over, just let me know. Again, my name's Nick. Uh, you can reach me directly at 614-502-7621. Thanks.